What's up guys, welcome back. Today I'm playing on the CaptureCraft SMP, which is a server I have not played on before. This server is played in sessions, which means it's not open all the time, so I'm gonna try to get one video out a week. This episode is of sessions one and two. Hopefully I'll give each episode its own video moving forward. But yeah, I'm gonna have the owner of the server, Amy Squid, explain the rules and the idea of the server to you guys. Welcome to the CaptureCraft SMP, where your goal is to be the last empire standing. The SMP is a plugin that allows you to claim a chunk for yourself. This means nobody else can break or place blocks in that chunk. But be careful as enemies can still wander in, so build walls and defenses to keep people out and make your empire the strongest. So if you didn't get that, basically, you can craft chunk claimers to claim chunks and you want to have by the end of the server the server will end when only one person has chunks claimed and everybody else has all their chunks not claimed so you can claim chunk you can also use the unclaimer to unclaim other people's chunks so i basically did normal minecraft stuff you know getting stone and then iron but my eventual goal was to get a diamond which i know you always want diamonds in minecraft but on this server in order to craft the chunk claimer you do need a diamond so, once you craft this chunk claimer, basically, you can claim as many chunks as you want using that chunk claimer. But, you can only claim a certain amount per episode, there's a limit. On the first session, you were only allowed to claim three. The second session, I believe it was five. So, I began my mission to find a cave with diamonds in it. So the first cave I found sadly did not contain any diamonds, but it did have plenty of iron, which you know, I do need iron to get diamonds, so, you know. So, uh, then something not very good happened. Yeah, I died. Um, you're gonna see this as a recurring theme in this episode. I then uh, did eventually get my stuff back, so that was good, I guess. I then went looking for another cave because I had basically mined all the ore available in the cave I had just been in. So another thing to talk about is the world border. The world border does expand each session, but for the first session it was at 1000 by 1000 blocks. I then did find another very promising cave with potential for diamonds inside. Although I didn't find diamonds, I did eventually find a mine shaft. So I did eventually get out of the mine shaft and find a deep side part of the cave, but it didn't exactly go too well. I died again. So, after searching for a long time, I was not able to find my stuff, and basically had to start over. And that's how I ended session 1, with basically nothing. Which was not very good, because I was very behind, and there was already people that had almost full diamond armor. So, I needed to catch up and grind really hard on session 2. So at the beginning of session 2, I made myself an area inside of the mountain and decided that I was going to strip mine for diamonds. That's what I was going to do, because I need to get a diamond to claim chunks, because that's the whole point of the server, and there are people that had already claimed almost 5 chunks, and I was very behind having claimed none. So, I strip mined for a while and eventually found a cave, and from the cave I strip mined and eventually found diamonds.
So, using the diamond, I crafted a chunk claimer. It had taken me so long to find diamonds that by the time I finally got the chunk claimer, the session was coming to an end. So I had to be quick. Found the chunk I wanted to claim, and I claimed it. I officially had finally claimed a chunk. Thanks for watching, guys. I know this episode is a bit late compared to other people's episode twos, but I tried. All right, episode three, four, and so forth coming soon. Like and subscribe.